Come on, that trap. Catch something. Here we go. Hold on. Oh! Oh my God. Joey Slam. What up, Slayers? We're back at it with another safe adventure, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to use my famous giant net trap. That is right, guys. We're gonna go ahead and capture some fish in this beautiful lake, see what comes out. We can lay it on the floor, examine it, see what's going on. And on top of that, we're going to predatory fins to check on our beautiful albino peacock bass to see how he's doing, see if the colors are the same, if anything has changed, if it's still even albino. Maybe it's a paradox. Maybe it's black and white or red all over. I have no idea what's gonna happen, guys. But first and foremost, guys, welcome to the channel. If you're new, I'm Joy Slam. Go ahead and subscribe as well as add Why is there always a bird? <laughs> or a plane. Something. It always I'm like a little squirrel. I always get <laughs> I always get distracted. But guys, like I was saying, go ahead and hit those notifications to get notifications on the channel, guys. I don't know what's going on. I need my slayers to go ahead and give me some love. Hit up on the comments. I'm gonna be doing some shout-outs soon. If you guys wanna get it shouted out in the next video, go ahead and hit those notifications so I can go ahead and give you guys a shout-out. So guys, without further ado, let me show you my giant net trap. My giant net trap is what others call a cast net. That is right, guys. My giant net trap is a cast net. And what's amazing about these cast nets, they're a great way to get bait for fish you want to catch, to get food if you're hungry and you like those type of bluegill. Uh, if you want to go ahead and actually catch other types of fish or feed your monster fish. So we just roll this up like so, so it can fit into that box. And I throw it and catch some stuff pretty simple i'll show you guys how to do it it's not that hard we might even have lily throw a couple oh boy oh boy is right <laughs> <laughs> the pressure is gonna be on <laughs> you're gonna be able to see it also guys i've noticed some comments you guys really want me to do a golf vlog if i get 50 comments saying to go ahead and show you an entire video of how i play with catching my fishing and my friends maybe even fish some golf courses i'll do it so guys all this bait it's actually gonna be for some of the fish I have at home, but mainly for that albino peacock bass. I wanna see if he's eating and he's doing well. I haven't talked to Rod in a while. He's been so busy remodeling the entire warehouse. So we're gonna, we're gonna have a nice little sneak peek today at the warehouse. I'm excited about that. So without further ado, I haven't done this in a while. Come on, net trap, catch something. That was a terrible throw. On a scale of one to terrible, that was like uber terrible. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Shut up. <laughs> okay. You're tired from golfing all day. What do you guys? mean? I don't golf. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you're even wearing your polo. Guys, he's ready. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. All right, let's see what happens. Hello? Anyone home? Oh boy. Oh boy. Not a, oh not a damn thing in this thing. All right, we'll try one more throw. Then we're going to bust the move because I know another spot that has a lot of stuff. All right. That's a pain. That was nice. Yeah, you're welcome. Nice little if evening If things don't pancake. work out on YouTube, I can just work at IHOP, you know? <laughs> Throwing them pancakes up and stuff like that. All right. Come on. Let's see it. I think it sunk just enough. This net trap is amazing. She catch just about anything and everything. I guess I didn't catch anything. All right, guys, we're checking another spot because this spot sucks. All right, guys, so we busted a move and we walked a couple blocks down. We got some agua water for those who don't know how to speak Spanish. So here I have my giant net trap and I have the loop of truth. Now I open this loop. I use this line, put it through the loop, put it on my hand, tie it nice and tight. Then I twist this line, put it over this hand again. This allows the net trap not to fly away when I throw it. So I roughly retrieve the line, just about arm's length apart, just like this, to coil it, nice, even circles. I grab this red doohickey, put it on top. If you guys really want to know, this name is it's called the horn. But just grab it roughly about halfway. And I can throw this all day. It's not always, it's not going to be the prettiest pancakes, but it'll get the job done. Watch. I'll open up just like that. 
Some people like irregular sized pancakes. I like pancakes. It just depends on where the pancakes are coming from. <laughs> you know, if they're from the chest or they're from like IHOP or whatever. Anyways, guys, this is sinking right now. Live nine to five. I thought the glasses would help. It's nice and dark. It's dusk. And I can usually catch a lot of stuff in this net trap around this time. And I don't have anything in here for sure. It's not even wiggling, dude. It's too cold. That's crazy. It is way too freaking cold. All right. Well, I'm going to be out here relentlessly throwing one bajillion times until we can catch something in this net trap. The weather really does affect the fish, especially like the pressure and everything like that. Come on. Open up, baby. Thank you. It's nice. It's nice. I'm telling you, man. It's going to work out at IHOP or Denny's. Whichever you prefer. All right, come on. Kind of showing you guys some raw footage today, nothing too crazy. Just using this beautiful net trap. Not trying to do anything out of the ordinary. Sometimes you can get colorful fish like I usually do. Bluegills, the whole nine yards. There's a lot of action going on right now because like I said, it's that evening bite. All right, it's sunk all the way to the bottom. Let's see if we got anything. Oh yeah, we got some wiggle wiggles. Some squiggly wigglies. Oh, we got the giant something. What is this? Oh my gosh, a plecker? It's an alien fish, dude. Alien armored catfish right here, guys. Check this out. So guys, let's go ahead and get this thing out. This looks like an armored catfish that you can go ahead and buy at a pet store. And these were released in the wild here in South Florida. These are invasive species. You're encouraged to kill these, but I don't like to kill things, but unfortunately we do have to eradicate them. So we're gonna do that today, unfortunately. Even though I am a fish keeper, I do wanna make sure that my natural fish here in South Florida survive and thrive. These guys bury holes and just ruin the substrate. Look at this, ow! Look at this massive armored catfish, he is pissed. If I can just grab him, look at these spikes right here. I'm gonna go grab him real quick. Oh, he is savage. He is savage. Now guys, if you look right here, we have these same barbs that most catfish have. They're nice and tough. I don't know if you wanna zoom into that. Check that out right there. It's pretty wild. Nice and tough. Look at the spike. And if you zoom in onto their face right here, these things right here, hold the face of the catfish in place when it's protecting a nest. Now these are called sailfin catfish or plecos or pecos blah, 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 and stuff like that. But they're pretty cool fish, super armored. Like, look at that. Come over here, look at the scales and the, and the spikes. It's crazy, this is a pretty big one. Oh! oh. Wild stuff like a right here. Dragon. It's literally like a little dragon. If you hold this wrong, you can literally slice your hand open and then die all right so we're gonna have to get rid of this guy i'm not gonna be able to show you that on camera stop following me camera sorry stop following me we're gonna have to deal with that guy but we did not get skunked we did not get skunked with our giant net trap i will not give up if you don't succeed you try try again you never give up you <laughs> never surrender and i won't surrender unless it's to my women when it's the right <laughs> time but do this. I believe we gotta get we gotta get like one or two baits. That's all I really need. <laughs> I just need a couple baits. This cold weather's got everything hiding right now. I think we hit the bottom. He ho Let's see what you got. Store. Come on. Let's go, baby. Hello. Any Juan home. Hello? Dude. I caught the the worst thing ever <gasps> hope <laughs> dang bro we're out here catching nothing but hope guys oh look at this it's wild man wild stuff everything's popping off next to me should i go that way i think next you to the should bed? let's let's see if i can do something real quick hey. nice. a little further out a little further out oh dude i think i got something this this line's moving i believe oh my god come on Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Hold on. Oh, oh my gosh. Armored catfish again, guys. Again. 
Look at this thing. You gotta be very careful because they can ruin your net trap. Look at the different colors of this one. Jeez. This one looks like it's it's pregnant or something. Yeah. So big and thick. Hold. Just gotta get very careful. And make sure you don't get wrecked. Jeez. All right, we're gonna have to get rid of this guy too. All right. Hold. Ow! Oh. No! Oh. That didn't happen. So we took 5.4 steps and there's a lot of grass here. There's a lot of cover for the fish we want. So hopefully I come up with fish and some salad, some protein and greens. Oh boy. He. Feel anything? Oh. Oh, stuff was jumping out, you saw? Yeah. Anyone? Oh, yes. I see some life. Yes, yes. Oh, okay, guess we're running. Yes, my colorful fish on my own. Hello. Greetings, Earthling. You shall be sacrificed. You shall be sacrificed. You shall be sacrificed to the mighty albino fish. I think we got exactly what we need. We have so many. Look at the babies. Oh. Look at the babies. They shall be sacrificed. These guys are also invasive guys. These are Mayan cichorids. And they were released again via the pet trade but these are prime baits for a peacock bass large mouse anything it's great fodder for them they're eat and survive look at these little guys hello little babies hello, baby. goodbye my friend so guys i hope you enjoyed this episode don't forget to like and subscribe if you guys want more silly videos let me know in the comments below and we will see you guys on the next adventure oh yeah <laughs>